Star Project Chronicle. She's got at least 394 subscribers and around 78,547 views. She could kick your ass in less time than it would take her to make a delicious mug of tea. It's Abigail Dufo. Good morning, guys. Oh, hey, two minutes to noon. That's really just morning. Um, so, for those of you who don't know, here in Canada, it is Thanksgiving, and I don't know why ours is in October and Americans have theirs in November. I'm sure there's some valid historical reason I couldn't tell you for the life of me. Um, so, I thought I would spend today telling you what I am thankful for, and this needs to be minimized or I will keep looking at my face like usual. Okay, so, I am thankful that even though sometimes it's annoying, I am thankful that I have very considerate in-laws that let us live here for six months or so while our house is being built. I am thankful that I have a wonderful and sweet and understanding husband who is very considerate to the fact that working can sometimes be difficult and so he is okay with me applying for jobs that I know will be easy on me as opposed to just applying for a lot of jobs that maybe some of them would maybe make my health worse. Um, I am thankful to live in a com in a country where healthcare is more or less free or paid for by taxes and I don't have to shell a lot out of pocket, especially because I have a lot of health problems. Um, I am thankful that, oh I'm sure there's, I'm thankful that I have a big mug of tea in front of me. That is something I am very thankful for. And I am thankful for good friends and family to enjoy this crazy ride called life that we all live. So that is what I am thankful for. Um, in other news, I did a box swap a while back with some with a kid that I met online, and he's like 16. He's from Cherry Hill, New Jersey, and uh, he sent me a stack of magic cards. I'd never owned magic cards in my life. I'm like, oh, cool, yeah, I kind of wanted to get into it, but I wasn't really sure where to start. I know it's expensive, but he sent me a big fucking stack of magic cards. And I'm like, oh, yeah, neat. And now I'm looking, I looked through them yesterday, and they're so old. So, uh, for those of you who don't know, Magic is the game on which Hearthstone is based. It's Hearthstone's like a very simplified version of Magic, apparently. Um, and it is... Wizards of the Coast has been producing magic cards since 1993. Well, um, when you play in tournaments, there's only certain editions you can pull cards from. They'll say, okay, you can only go back three um, card packs, or you can only go back four or five or whatever, or you can only play from the new set. Well, so this was formed, uh, Wizards of the Coast started making magic cards in 93. My oldest cards in here are from 95, and the newest ones are from 2005, so they're anywhere from 9 and 19 years old. <laughs> So I have some very old magic cards. Um, they're really cool. I like them. I think they're interesting. Um, but he definitely didn't give me cards that would help me make a deck because there is no uh, land or mana. That, for those of you who know what that is, if not, it's a way for you to be able to play your creatures and your spells and stuff. You need what are called land or basically what mana is in Hearthstone. And yeah, so I have all these cards. They aren't really any good for me right now, but they're pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, so I have a date with a friend on Wednesday morning, or afternoon rather, to, uh, learn how to maybe utilize this into a deck, and then if I can't, because they're too old and the mechanics are all different and whatnot, um, I may just borrow cards from her until I decide whether or not I want to actually spend money and make this into a hobby, which I think could be really fun. Um, so I've been learning what little I do know from Magic uh, from watching Spellslingers, which is a show on the Geek and Sundry YouTube channel. Um, they are the ones that also do Tabletop, which is where I get all of my uh, extreme excitement for board games from. Not all of it, but that's where I pick which ones I want to buy next. Um, and yeah, we had a huge get to got huge. Well, two people came over yesterday, but it seemed huge because we, they were there for quite a long time. We watched the new Dragon Ball Z movie that just came out on DVD this past week, uh, Battle of Gods. And I went and saw it in theaters with my husband. It was really good. Um, it was cool to see it. Oh, my phone is ringing. Go away. Um, it was cool to see it. Uh, with the extended stuff, there was some uncut stuff that was in the Japanese version that they didn't uh, dub over 
for the English version in theaters, but it's on the DVD. So we watched that. That was really neat. Um, and then we ordered Indian food because Indian food is delicious. And then we played, um, they were playing Spelunky on the PS4, which was pretty interesting. <laughs> it was really funny. It is a rogue game where every time you die, you have to start back at the beginning and you lose all your stuff. Um, so that was fun to watch. And then we moved upstairs to a big table and we played a lot of Love Letter. We played some Zombie Dice because we had just gotten a new expansion for Zombie Dice. And then one of our friends and I played another like three games of Love Letter, which I ended up winning two of them. But yeah, it was a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, so today's Thanksgiving. Um, today we are supposed to be going with to go see your family. I am currently flaring up, so I don't know if I'm going to be going. We shall see how I feel in a couple hours. But uh, yeah. And then tomorrow's with my family, and that's always crazy, which again, I don't know if I'll be going to if I'm still flaring. So anyway, that is it for today. In comments down below or on Twitter or on Google+, Plus, which I sometimes maybe check, um, let me know what you're thankful for, even if it's not your Thanksgiving today. Let me know what you're thankful for. One thing, just one thing. Um, but yeah, you know the deal. Like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Have a beautiful day.